What's up guys, Chris Chris here, today I'm going back at it again in Black Ops 4, and today we're using the Stingray with an unnecessary amount of attachments, and actually I saw a comment on the last video that said I should use the Stingray, and I realized I don't think I've literally ever used the Operator mod for this gun. By the time I unfortunately unlocked the Stingray, the Operator mod had kind of been nerfed, and I just didn't think it was as good as, well, what it used to be, and it'll never be as good as what it was. Good lord, that was frustrating going up against that, back when it was, you know, pre-nerf. But yeah, haven't really used it. No idea if it's actually any good after that nerf at all. So yeah, we're going to jump in a game and see how we do. I also think it's funny that I put a camo on here that if I get, you know, kills, it'll have sharks on instead of stingrays. Oh well. Do sharks and stingrays get along? Do they hate each other? Is there any sort of relationship there at all? I don't know. What do I look like? A marine biologist? Or someone who has the ability to Google stuff? Okay, that time I think the Operator mod saved me, and there's another guy there, but I think I actually used the Operator mod there to get a kill. It was the explosive damage that did him in. Oh, that is so slow. It's like watching me trying to think of funny things to say in real time there. Way too slow, man. Way too slow. Okay. Now he knows I'm here. I'm not gonna help him, but... <laughs> Alright. I'm not sure how I feel about this. Not sure if I chose the best other attachments for height. Oh god, you've got no. You're not supposed to have that. That ruins this entire gun, man. Thank god you're an idiot, but still. Oh, ah, oh, there you are again. I mean, I could still double tap you, I guess, but so doesn't really affect me too much. I think the goal of this gun is you're supposed to be able to one tap him. I don't know. Look at this guy using a dark matter peacekeeper over there. Okay, here we go. I don't know if I can one-tap people with this gun, which kind of feels like it's definitely worse than the regular version. Supposed to be able to doesn't seem to do a whole lot for me. Yeah, it just feels like you just two-tap everyone like the other regular base version. What is the point of this now? Oh, you think you're clever going around the flank? I'll show you a flank. Oh god, and someone else has, yep, someone else has decided to use one. Hi. Oh god, if I had missed every- wait, there's someone right behind me in there. Oh, he's right here. That was... painful. Every bit of that was painful. <laughs> what the crap is this gun? Oh, someone pulled out something. Hi. Ah, you again! Oh, and- Well, that happened. <laughs> what the hell? I guess I'm so used to having an engineer, I just didn't even think- for a second that that would be there. How much does this do to this? Well, that seems to destroy, or maybe probably someone else shot it. But still. I'm gonna assume it destroys that. No, no, no. No beating me. That's not allowed. I said no. Um, hi. No augering. God dang, why do these people all flak jackets? Like they're annoyed at me or something. Hmm. I love the Tempest. It makes these videos so much fun. <sighs> God, that is driving me nuts. Enemy Pretty much- oh! I was trying to see if I could destroy that, and someone walked into my shots. Okay, this doesn't seem to do much that much damage against that, and of course, that would go for me, because who else would it go for? No, no, you gotta bow out- no! Okay, I'm definitely feeling like the regular version of this gun is better. The operator mod- oh god, that's a knife. Um, the regular version definitely feels more powerful just because if you're going to take two bursts anyway, this regular version can shoot so much faster. Hi. Alright, last one, come on. And there it is. Boom, baby. Okay, literally a pretty big boom there when I hit him, but yeah. I would say that the rumors of them nerfing this- Operator mod in the ground is true, but we're gonna do this again for round two. Alright, so here for round two, we're just gonna switch this up a little bit. We're gonna swap out laser sight, because hip fire in this thing doesn't seem to be that effective anyway, and put on rapid fire to hopefully that increase our burst, or decreases the burst delay. Let's see if that changes things here in round two. Oh god, I am so nervous right now. Come on. Three, two, one. Oh, come on. Oh my god! It didn't happen. I cannot believe I... That's never happened. I've never honestly, I can't remember, I cannot honestly remember the last time I saw a lobby where Nuketown wasn't an option, 
and no one voted on it. Literally no one in this lobby voted on it. I think I was literally the only person to vote there. I voted anything else but Nuketown. Oh, thank God. I mean, I know it went well for us last time. I just hate that map. It doesn't care if I do well on it. I hate it. Screw that map. and Go to hell. Please don't ever come back. It's coming back next year. I just... I know it is. Deep down. And I've accepted that. All right. Here we go. Round two. Let's hope the rapid fire makes a difference. If only the rapid fire would get it close to the actual fire rate of this gun, then it'd be great. All right. Oh, crap. There's already someone. Oh, okay. That was interesting, to say the least. How did you not see me? I guess I'm just that unnoticeable. Which, oof, man. my That hurts a little bit. That hurts. Not gonna lie. Hey, you. Stop that. I just spawned here. Right here on the stairs. Hey, what? Well, he literally looked at me again and looked away. God, notice me! It's, God dang. I don't care if it's to my advantage they don't notice me. I just want some recognition a little bit at this point. Nope. Nope. And for the third? Nope. <laughs> oh, wow. I actually hit that. Wasn't expecting to at, the, at range with this gun. Okay, so that guy's... Probably just back on the stairs camping a little bit. He's going to get distracted by the other guy, and I'm going to run in and punch him. Nope. I think that the guy camping on the stairs was dead. Otherwise, I would have punched him. Hey, I punched that guy. <laughs> Not the person I was talking about at all, but I did it, because I said I would punch someone, so I punched him. Oh, wow. Hi. Um, okay. God, this gun is kind of inconsistent when you put this on. Nope, you... There's also someone over here. I'm gonna go for the person over here, because I got the high ground. Got the high ground again, if you come back. Wait, I just gave up the high ground. What am I doing? My master would be so ashamed of me right now. Also ashamed of that aim, but I don't think they're gonna see it, so we're good. Alright. Got my health out. Let's see if I completely waste it, as usual. Hey, guess what? I died. So, yep, as always, I completely wasted it. I mean, the reason I, the reason I do use Crash instead of really any other specialist is, one, I kind of want to use the gun, like, I don't want to get kills with specialist equipment because it's kind of about the stupid guns I'm using when I play these games. Get out of the corner, sir. And two, also the ammo is necessary because I don't have, you know, scavenger on this class. Enemies have destroyed your assault pack. Hey! What did it do to you? Also, what is with that guy? Why do I always have to three-tap that one specific guy? I have no idea what's going on there. That is so weird. Did she just run into the barbed wire? Because I think she just ran into the barbed wire. And she lived! Oh, how did- She literally ran through the barbed wire and lived. Okay, there we go. Didn't have to triple tap him for once. God, though, this really does destroy barbed wire, like, instantaneously. Doesn't really do crap against barricades. Haha! -ha! Oh, that was a shotgun. Come on, someone spawn. Oh, hi. That'll do. Ask and you shall receive, apparently. God, I wish I could get a life. It's not happening. Oh, whoa, that's a new guy. Hey. And also, there's a gun I haven't heard in a long time. The Tiger Shark. Completely forgot that gun even existed. Honestly, I think I might have figured out in our next video, maybe. Who knows? Tiger Shark first mod? You die, sir, when I shoot you, please! Just, God. Well, that was a fortunate timing for her. <laughs> that is some COD timing at its best right there. Okay, and there's a nomad camping in the back of a spawn with the same kind of gun as me. That's great. I love that. Okay, someone's punching something here. I'm just gonna put, punch him into the ground. That didn't work. That makes no sense. But who cares? I'm alive and they're dead, so it doesn't have to make sense. Oh boy, it's coming down the wire again, as it seems to do in these videos. I got this. There's gonna be someone here. I'm not gonna push that. Yep, near I got sharp on the side. Come on, push me, push me, push me. Alright, yes. You, whoever you are. Yes! Holy crap! <laughs> that actually worked perfectly! Oh god, that was not a great KD, but who cares? We win! They lose. That's what matters. <laughs> Good lord, I was starting to sweat there again. Hey, this is the guy who almost beat me. Who cares if you got play? I win! And... Oh god, oh god. Well, that was 
one of the weirdest kills I've seen in a while. Okay. <laughs> I honestly have no idea what happened there. That was me, in case you couldn't tell from the footage. That was actually me. <laughs> Here's what it looked like from my perspective. There's someone behind me. What? Yeah, see, nothing adds up there. Nothing adds up at all with that incident. But yeah, we're going to leave it there. If you enjoyed, please share. A like's always appreciated. And until next time, crisscross out.